Okay, today we'll be opening up this Made in Japan Subaru oil filter, number 15208AA160, which I got from Amazon for $15.80. And we'll be comparing it to this Made in Indonesia Subaru oil filter, number 15208AA20A, which I got for free. Yep, a very generous viewer whose name is Jeff Korsh from Okonomowoc, Wisconsin, sent me this Indonesia-made Subaru oil filter. Thanks, Jeff. These oil filters fit Jeff's 2021 Subaru Crosstrek. Yep, the one with a 2.5 liter engine. Hmm, made in Japan, made in Indonesia. Let's see who makes a better oil filter. So let's get started. Okay, let's start with the Made in Japan Subaru oil filter. And basically all the info is just filter number and it says Made in Japan. That's all the info on this box. So let's open it up and see what this filter looks like. And date code is, I believe this is a date code, 2CLA. Made in Japan. And if we look over here, it'll say Tokyo Rok Roki Company, LTD. They both say this, both filters. And they both come with this plastic steel on it. You know, over the base plate. And this filter has six inlet holes, metal core with holes, lots of holes there. Bypass valve down below. And about four grooves there for threads. With this O-ring style gasket. It's right in that groove. I've been told this is called a P-ring gasket also. Okay, let's look at this made in Indonesia Subaru oil filter. Same thing, just got the filter number, made in Indonesia. All right, let's take a look at this filter, see what it looks like. And this one has a date code right here on top. It's easy, March 1st, 2023. And also the same thing here, Tokyo Roku, Roki Company, LTD. And made in Indonesia. Filter number. Okay, and it also has this plastic. Here it goes. Also six cylinder holes. Metal core with holes. Different kind of holes there though. They look uh, bigger but spaced apart. Bypass valve down below. And four grooves there for threads. Also this O-ring style gasket. It fits right in that groove. Oh, it came right off. I'll measure these. So these filters look very similar, but the cores are different. I can see the inside of the cores are different. Base plates look similar. So let's cut these two filters open and see what they look like inside. Be right back. Okay, here they are cut open. Let's get their weights. Made in Japan. 227.3 grams Indonesia 232.9 grams take a look at the gaskets these gaskets are both the same same thickness I'll put that up on a screen but you can tell they're the same gaskets base plates Indonesia 89.2 grams Japan 88 grams and these guys also they're pretty much the same same amount of grooves there for threads. Same inlet holes. Basically the same, same base plates. Any drain back valves, they're both nitro rubber, but the Indonesia is a little bit bigger. And those fit over the inlet holes really nice. Yeah, those look good. Okay, filter elements. Start with the Indonesia, 76 grams. And the Japan, 74.1 gram. All right, let's take a look at this filter element. It's got metal crimp seam. And this made in Japan has 56 pleats. Pretty deep pleats. Nice and clean. These metal end caps. Bypass valve right here. Yeah, very clean filter. 
pleats are nicely spaced but I don't have a micron rating for this or what this filter media is made out of I don't have it for both filters so so what you see is what you get but these look this looks nice And uh, made on Indonesia filter, same thing, metal crimp seam, nicely spaced pleats, nice and clean, metal end caps, bypass valve right here. Yeah. And the Indonesia has three more pleats, 59 pleats. But it's a smaller filter media. Look at the size here, it's a difference. Because Indonesia has a spring, so it took up some space. Coil spring. And the made in Japan has this stamp leaf spring, which is pretty flat. This also has this little, I don't know what you would call this little retainer here for the spring, so it centers probably. And let's look at the cans. Indonesia, 51.9 gram. Japan, 52.4 grams. These guys are pretty much the same also. Yeah, right there. It's about 0 0.51 millimeters thick. And let me check out this one also. They're pretty much the same. Get here. I'm having a hard time getting a getting a reading on these guys because they're they're thick cans and they got a lip on them. You know, again like that maybe. Right there, 0 0.51 millimeters. And I'll measure these guys this way, and I'll minus a tenth of an inch. So 2.52 inches wide. Two point three three inches wide. Okay, so there's a little bit of difference. I'm gonna say the Japan made filter has got more filter media. What do you guys think? All right, let's uh, cut these two filters open, stretch them out, and see what they look like. Be right back. Okay, here they are, both stretched out. And the made in Japan Subaru oil filter is fifty eight inches long. And the Made in Indonesia filter media is 50 and a half inches long. Okay, let's get the thick designs, guys. This is the Made in Japan Subaru filter. 0.92 millimeters thick and the made in Indonesia filter is 0.79 millimeters thick so take a look at them up close there's the filtering side the back side and if you look under a microscope I think the made in Japan filter would do a little better job of filtering now let's take a look at that picture Yeah, so as you can see, the Made in Japan filter's got uh, less of those holes in there. You can see the light coming through. You also get about 28 square inches of more filter media with the Made in Japan filter. And let's take a look at the rest of the filter. So between these two filters, I would say the filter media is the biggest deciding factor on these guys. These uh, O-ring gaskets, they're both the same. Base plates and you know base plates are equal you got nitro rubber and jam back valves that that equals out you got a coil, coil spring versus stamp leaf spring they both got holes in the cores you can see the difference on the size of the core this core this uh indonesia filter has got a bigger fatter core whereas you got a bunch of little holes here bigger holes but less of them and these are smooth holes, both of them. So that, that would equal out there if you ask me. 
And the cans equal out as far as thickness goes. So between these two, I would take the Man in Japan filter just because it has more filter media. What do you guys think about these two filters? And again, I want to thank Jeff for sending me this Made in Indonesia oil filter. And I think I'll wrap this video up. And don't forget, oil filter Fridays. I try to open up an oil filter every Friday on this YouTube channel. So if you like this video, please hit that like button. Thanks for watching and take care. The Made in Japan filter media weighs 16.7 grams. The Made in Indonesia filter media weighs 13.7 grams.